This is a Mom Truth Friday. The mental load of motherhood is this notion that no one talks about because if they talk about it then what happens is men are like I got the mental load too I got a load in my pants (laughs) you don't know what it's like the pressures I have to be the man of this house you know what I say imagine this you know those backpacks that are leaders that backpackers take bigger than that it's like the baby carrier you know what it's like a two leaf the thing you put your skis on top of your roof rack you know the thing but it's on your back yeah you're carrying that so put in like heavy bricks dry cement pots and pans just junk a butterball turkey it yeah. doesn't make sense Forks, it's spoons, like it's like a hoarder's sheets. house on your back being a mother with children in your brain is like walking into not Marie Kondo's house the opposite a hoarder's house. a hoarder's house then you're worried about where you're taking them what you're doing what direction are they gonna go in life who are they gonna be they're psychotic right now how am I gonna mold this person that's only one kid put like seven on your back because each kid at least carries two loads. Okay, well seven wouldn't be anything times two. The motherhood load is so f***ed up. I can't even do my math. Then you take a bit of anxiety for each kid. Because if you're not anxious about your kids, you probably don't have them. <laughs> if you don't have anxiety about your children, you're not a mom. They're probably No, not. you actually don't have kids. So that's like a monkey on your head, jumping constantly like this. How many kids do you have? Four? Four? Oh, sh- you got monkeys everywhere. Small monkeys that are getting caught in my hair. <laughs> like those plastic ones. And you try to grab them and, and then like, they move. Oh, and then everything falls apart yeah. when you try to grab one. Yeah, we haven't even tackled our anxiety yet. That's like putting yourself in a box that you don't fit in. Yes. It's like trying to squeeze into a pair of jeans that just came out of the truck. What about the anxiety of your marriage? That's, That's anxiety about having sex. That because I'm you want to, I don't want to put lingerie you on. Want but I lingerie? Should. Oh God, I got a fupa. You know, I saw somebody comment that their husband likes their fupa. I don't know why. What do I you do with it? I, I did not. Motorboat it? I, I, mm. Because the emotions that then the stress that come from your marriage because you want to have like have a happy marriage so your kids can see a good right. example is like a f-ing Mack truck full of junk. And then you have friends that you're supposed to have. Oh god! We haven't even tackled working out yet. Then there's like these piles in the house that just keep growing. Society, Society. has decided to say that men are more involved than ever. But you know what? They might be helping out in the house, but they're not helping up up here. What they don't understand. Can I just say one not thing? dogging the dad. No, of course not. Because dads are amazing. Oh, more so Thank you. Class. That was a fast one. Dads, we do love Listen, you. Listen, the only thing with dads, too, is that they, when they take care of them, we're like, mm, it wasn't really that hard. I kept the house clean, I cooked, and I took the kids everywhere they need to be. The only reason you're able to do that is because you're not carrying around the toolie of you're emotions right. and worries. And you don't have a Mack truck. You don't care. Yeah. Is my wanky going to get wet tonight? <laughs> That's all you need. Is my wanky going to get wet tonight? We going to free Willie tonight or no? Is amusement park closed? Wow, we're like... And then even when we're at the amusement park, your brain is still like, oh shit, right, back to the amusement park. But wait, I'm still carrying 500,000 things. Like this, but the, oh wait, back to you. Oh, and I work full time. Just say. You know what I want to be? What do you want to be? A dad. No, don't want to be them either. And if you are a super mom, AKA a solo mom, AKA a single mom, well, you are amazing. And if you're a dad who's about to leave a comment or a man who's like, no, you women, no. Go find your own page. This is a woman page. Not about you. It's It's about about us. And the mental load. load. If you don't know it, you'll never know it. Maybe unless you're a single dad, then you got the load. You can join the club. Happy Moment Truth Friday. Like, share, and subscribe, and come and see us live on catnet.ca. Like live tour? Like we're live. Like we're live. Yeah. Like come and see us in real life. Come to tour.